Okay, yeah. we're going to keep them going because I want to try to get all of them in. And, and, and the next one coming up is, uh, I want to say this is Katie, yes. Miss Katie Goldstein. Is that correct? Yes. All right. And now you, you're going to do, I guess you wrote yours too. I know this is by Tom Stoppard. Well, we'll pretend you wrote it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, That's you know, my now, where are you going to go to school? <laughs> now, you, you're Carnegie Mellon. Oh, yeah, okay, Carnegie Mellon. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> all right, it's all yours, girl. I feel sick. When you look down from a great height, you feel dizzy. Such depth. Such distance, such disappearing tininess, so far away, rushing away, reducing the life size to nothing. It, it upsets the scale you live by. The eyes go first, followed by the head. And if you can't look away, you feel sick. And that's my view of time. And I can't look away. Dizziness spirals up between my stomach and my head, corkscrewing out the stopper, but I'm empty anyway. Because it goes on, this endless dividing up into equal parts, this keeping track. Because time, viewed from such distance, is rushing away, reducing the lifespan to nothing. The spirit goes first, followed by the mind. And if you can't look away, you go mad. That's deep stuff there. You know, that, that, you know, that, that, that's beyond me there. I can't, I, I can't do that. But in arts, that's what it comes down to. Dap's going to get mad at me if I take a break of any kind. So I'm going to get our next young lady to step up. Now, th this young lady, I didn't know it, but we know her already. This is Christian. We know her mom, Julie. How are you? Good. <laughs> now, you're, you're going, where are you going to go to school? Marymount, Manhattan. Okay. All right. There, and she there. wrote this poem. Yeah, and she wrote this one. So it's all yours, Christian. Okay. Love's not a game to play. It's a tool I use, no different than the makeup I apply or the promises you supply to me. It's not in these veins to love, and it's certainly not in these hips to make it. It's not in a ring to give or a finger to take it. It doesn't lie beneath your belt buckle or hide between my open thighs. It's just a tool. A tool I use to kiss me up in the morning or to fight my shame with in the evening as you kiss me beneath cotton. It's an instrument I play to make hate sound like it's wrong. It's an excuse for me to say I'm not ugly, I'm just human. It's a paintbrush I dipped green to paint envy into appreciation. A mold I shove myself into to shape this lack of a motivation into a sterile situation where I don't have to contribute anything anymore, I just have to love. It's a certain hue that I wear that makes this body more appealing for your eye and your ear. And while, yes, love can paint a beautiful picture or create a better version of me, love has taught me something more valuable than what I ever thought that I would use it for. That while I use these tools every day, love cannot make you care. Which was all I ever really wanted. A replacement with your lips on mine, with the great divide, and those words, I'll always be there. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking they started hating guys at a young age. I, I, I thought it was as we got older, but they, they, they just no, like no. this to begin with. Exactly. Right? Okay. exactly. And our, our next young lady, I'm going to have her step down here. Now, she's not going to do any poem because one of the things, you have theater, you yes. have dance, music. Yes. This very accomplished young lady. Tell me. And they all sing and dance, but she is very a very fine uh, ballet dancer. Yeah. And she is also a very fine actress, and uh, she's going on to college next year. Yeah, now, we're, now you're going, uh, I, I believe you're going with Kelly. Yes, University that? of the Arts in Philadelphia. Yeah, and uh, you're hopefully on a partial scholarship. Yes. As, as, as dancer. Yeah. Oh, I'm a yeah. dance major. Because uh, Kelly said you're a really good dancer. Now, you're a ballet, I guess you take ballerinas. To, to I, I take ballet, but I... Do other forms of dance too. Yeah, yeah. I do jazz. But maybe next time, maybe maybe we come visit the school. We're talking okay. about that because what a great school and everything. Uh, I, I want to thank the girls. Give the girls a big hand for coming out today. <laughs> you guys do such a tremendous job. Hopefully, we'll get to learn a little bit more about it. But it, it, you, not anybody can get in this. I want people to understand. You have to qualify to get. This is special kids. Yes, they're very special kids. They're very smart and they're very talented. And we have assessments that we do. 
and um, it's um, it'd be a great opportunity. So we we hope anyone with any money desire, has no matter on it. No it's desire all, is the important thing. That, that, and heart, and, and yes. that's what I'm learning because you, you, know, you guys can test a little bit and see what kind of hearts there and what the desire to do what they're doing. Right. And what a fantastic job! And my Good. my hats off to you and the, and the entire gang down there. Thank like you. I said, hopefully Good. we'll come down there and we'll get some of the girls. Now, when's Good. graduation taking place? Graduation is June. First, guys, June June first, yep. and it's going to be yeah. actually this year they're going to do it at the Baby Grand. Oh wow! And yeah. uh, we have uh, coming up a lot of performances in April, so they can go out to the website. Maybe we maybe, maybe we can get down there before they graduate, get some footage at the school. We'll That'd be a lot shot. of fun. So you know, so they can have something to take on with them, so they can remember their friends too. How Excellent. Yeah. Yep. Well, I, I thank you for coming thank by. Never, it's always a pleasure. Check out Cab Calloway. What's that address, guys? Cab Calloway School of the Arts <laughs> Okay. All right. <laughs> Stay with us. We'll be right back. Big hand for the girls. <laughs> 